Hello there guys, welcome back to my channel Travel Wonderful. Hello my wonderful people, how are you? I am so excited with this beautiful background, this amazing seaside. I want to invite you to this video as I'm gonna be showing you the, one of the beauties of Venezuela, which is the National Park Morrocoy, located in the Falcon State. And it is one of the most popular national parks in all Venezuela because if it's incredible nature and all the Cayos, which are small islands in which you can visit with a speedboat. So I'm gonna be showing you what this experience is like. Remember to subscribe to the channel if you like this video and remember to leave a comment below. Enjoy the video, travel wonderful. This is a very, very beautiful environment here at the National Park Morrocoy. We started this journey very early uh, in which we left the Caribbean Marina Suites roughly around 9 in the morning. And from there, we went all the way to the pier called Las Luisas, in which we took this speedboat uh, that took us all the way from Tucacas to this beautiful National Park Morrocoy. But before that, we did a little stop in which we had amazing Venezuelan breakfast, empanadas. We had them filled with a cazón, which is a kind of fish typical here in Venezuela, and pabellón as well. So it was really delicious. They cost roughly around two US dollars each, so really, really good. It was in a place called La Mallorquina. And now we are here. We took uh, roughly 15, 20 minutes from that pier to arrive here to this incredible, incredible Cayo. This Cayo is called Cayo Sombrero and it's one of the largest of the National Park Morocoy and one of the most popular as well. Right now it's not so busy because it's very early. So it gets really, really packed later. And well, we are enjoying so much. We took uh, this speedboat from a friend, however, uh, I can tell you that this can cost, if you want to do it by yourself, uh, roughly around 200 to 250 US dollars to rent a good speedboat for the whole day. And yes, from here we're gonna be exploring other Cayos, which are these little islands that make up the National Park Morocco. So you can walk around all this Cayo and walk and walk, and you're gonna be so relaxed among all these beautiful nature and all these palm trees that definitely gives a Caribbean touch to this amazing National Park Morocoy and specifically to this Cayo of Cayo Sombrero. It's very important to know that this is one of the most popular Cayos because it's one of the largest ones. And here everyone comes to enjoy themselves among all this beautiful seaside and all this incredible nature. So the people you can see, they come in their speedboats over there and enjoy the music, have some drinks, or simply relaxing themselves. You've got people here that sells you all kinds of things, uh, like food, drinks, and obviously services for umbrellas and sea chairs. So yeah, really complete experience here at the Cayo Sombrero Key. And before we continue with the video, guys, make sure you give a like, so do it right now. Subscribe to the channel and activate notifications so that you enjoy more videos like this in the future. Roughly five minutes from Cayo Sombrero, we arrived to another amazing Cayo here in the National Park Morrocoy, which is called Cayo Pescadores. And it's a bit smaller than Cayo Sombrero, but in here the waters are even bluer, more turquoise color. Look how beautiful it is. And another amazing particularity about this Cayo is that you got people coming uh, to sell you different kinds of seafood, drinks, everything, whatever you would like to eat, prawns, oysters. So it's a really nice environment as well because we don't have as many people as in Cayo Sombrero. Uh, so it's very nice for relaxation. So really, really, really nice here Cayo Pescadores as well. From here, we're gonna go probably to another Cayo. And by the way, just a few minutes ago, we went to a part in which you can go down, like do kind of a snorkel. And also you can see a statue of uh, La Virgen del Valle, which is the Holy Virgin uh, for the fishermen. So people that loves fishing, especially in this coast of the National Park Morrocoy, they pray to the Virgin uh, del Valle for them to uh, get more fish. So really interesting and have a look how beautiful is 
under the water. So here we go, my sister Antonella, which is coming with me. So what do you think about the experience here so far? Well, I think it's really nice here at the beach. Um, it's really like uh, relaxing and uh, it's really warm. So it's something different. You have to come and see and try it here, guys. It's really nice. Priscilla, Yagnela, there is Jody, which is the boyfriend of my sister. What do you think? I think the camera can describe enough what we see with our eyes. It's a very nice paradise here. Very nice. Thank you so much. Enjoy, yes? <laughs> There we go, the captain is just relaxing, and yes, everyone just relaxing and enjoying themselves here in the National Park Morocoi, which is so beautiful. It is Friday, and it's not as busy as I thought it would be, but I guess people are still working, and they probably come in the late afternoon or from tomorrow to spend the Saturday and Sunday here. But definitely it's a paradise, guys. So as I was saying before, a uh, speedboat like this, it costs roughly around 200 to 260 dollars uh, to rent it for a whole day. It can take you uh, pretty much everywhere uh, around the National Park Morocoi. Um, it's important to note that that's to up to seven to 10 people. So yeah, when you divide that, between seven people it's not bad at all the price so I think it's not very cheap but it's not very expensive either I was telling to Jody which is my brother-in-law that it cost me in Greece roughly around 100 euros per person for a speedboat similar size to go around so obviously when we compare it to other countries then the price is not as bad. So obviously in this um, speedboat, you got space to put your drinks. Like if you go ice, you can put it in here as well. And yes, we are drinking rum from Venezuela, which is called Santa Teresa, and it's delicious. This rum costs roughly around $28. And we brought also Carupa, no? Very, very good. It's his favorite actually. Uh, well, yes, enjoying with this beautiful weather some drinks as well. So as you can see there are different tonalities of blue over here. If you go a little bit further it's a little bit darker blue. But on this part is so turquoise and delicious the water. Really really good. And yeah we got even some more that's, that just arrived now. Obviously those ones for rent they will be even more expensive. Or maybe they are owners of that yacht. But a yacht like that costs probably around 700 US dollars for one day if you wish to rent. So a bit more expensive, but if you are a lot of people, probably it's not so bad a price. But yeah, so relaxing here, the environment at the National Park Morocoi. We're still in Cayo Pescadores. On the other side, we got that little sort of island over there, very solitary. But so nice with the particularity of those, you know, like mangroves and vegetation really beautiful it's like a paradise of the water is very pleasant it's either it's neither not cold and not hot it's very warm so that make it you know very enjoyable when coming here to the keys to the Cayos. It's a very very relaxing time here at the National Park Morocoi. So very beautiful weather, very beautiful beach and very beautiful company. Here my family they are currently playing volleyball sort of <laughs> while enjoying this beautiful weather here. It's very quiet I got to say but that's even better if you want a more relaxed time so then come you know during the week i would say monday to friday and if you want a bit more crazy like more party boom 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 then come saturday so but either way whenever you come it's amazing and also it's very important to note that the water levels are very low over here and you got a lot of sort of like small sandbanks all throughout this uh, key so it makes it very easy to walk so you don't actually have to swim so very enjoyable and it's perfect for families with small children so you can walk all over this amazing Cayo of los pescadores and have a relaxing and beautiful day here in Venezuela in the national park Morocoi so we were playing here uh, volleyball right now and then came one of these guys offering you like seafood so they deliver it pretty much like to your meat boat and we got here the the pana the friend, the friend. Melchi Cabrera. Melchi Cabrera. he's not the baseball player but it's the guy here
<laughs> and he offers you uh, a bit of everything, octopus, yeah, mixed platter he's serving currently, lobsters, octopus, ceviche, prawns, a bit of everything. For good price, for buen precio. For runner.com. <laughs> So he makes us an offer of three like full uh, plates that usually he charge for twenty dollars. So three for fifty dollars. So you, it's very important that you need to negotiate here the prices. I can negotiate, verdad? Claro. <laughs> so he make it in the moment for you. You got really nice octopus over there. Pulpito. <laughs> so what do you think of this? I think it's amazing. Like... <laughs> You from haven't seen sea, this in Italy, right? From the sea to your mouth, very fresh. <laughs> ¿Cuándo capturaste todo eso? Patrón, esto yo lo compro y lo revendo, pero uh, esto fue hoy mismo en la mañana. He sells it, he buy it and he resells it, but he says it's been all uh, taken very early this morning. Esto viene recién hecho como los panes, recién salido del horno. Just out of the oven, he's saying. So these are the plates. So we pay three of those, like with octopus, prawns, uh, more octopus over there, like calamari and ceviche. Three of these for fifty dollars. So what do you think? Is this expensive? You got to consider that we are on the beach, so that's literally no restaurants or anything else over here and it's completely fresh it looks delicious what do you think let me know in the comments right now so delicious guys it's so fresh delicious tasty mm, really really good it's worth it so three plates for 50 dollars not cheap not expensive i think it's decent price but you need to negotiate obviously always and while we're eating look what we got here we got a pez globo which is kind of friendly <laughs> it's not gonna do nothing to you I hope you can appreciate him in the camera. <laughs> Is it good, Jody? Está bueno. Bueno. Everyone thinks it's very good. Look at this. So fresh. Mm. So good, guys. And at the end, he's offering even one more. He's saying one more. So we're gonna pay four, four of those for sixty dollars. So it's so good that. He saw that we wanted kind of more and he offered us Okay, we, I'm gonna give you one more for extra 10 So it's all about negotiating <laughs> Instead of paying $80 for four We paying $60 for four of them So not bad We start giving a little bit of food to the fish over here And look how many, so many of them coming over here So we have right now to another amazing Cayo here in the National Park Morocoy. We are in Cayo Los Juanes, which is also very famous and popular. Oh, and here we got my friend from Sardinia. He's showing proudly his drink. Uh, yeah, in here as well, you got people selling you things. We got some jets at the very background as well. Uh, yeah. The particularity about this Cayo is that when it's like weekends, I mean, right now you cannot appreciate it very much, people come in their yachts, speed boats, and they all park like next to each other while listening to music. I mean, sort of like this style. But so many, so many, so many. I'm gonna show you anyway a little bit of footage so you can see it. And people dance, enjoy, drinks all next to each other so this is like a callo for the party people while enjoying this beautiful nature as well so not far from callo los juanes we go here another statue of the virgin of the valle in here people come and leave their tributes and uh, really nice messages in this very big rock in which she's at so it's very very beautiful so if you are a catholic person or a religious person it's worth coming here at least for a couple of minutes to look at this beautiful statue so this is it for this video guys thank you so much for watching and as usual leave your thoughts on the comments about this beautiful national park morocoy and about the beaches of venezuela thank you so much for watching travel wonderful